Hey guys, EBP Man here. Now in today's video, we're gonna take a look at the Zbeck TriScreen 2. Uh, these are portable screens that basically expand the power, the productivity of any laptop three times. Let's go ahead and check them out. Now many of us are working from home or going to school from home and having an immersive experience with a laptop, for example, becomes really difficult. Uh, that's where the Zbeck TriScreen 2 comes in. It actually expands your laptop to have two additional screens giving you almost like a cockpit experience, a very immersive experience that's gonna boost productivity, um, not once, not twice, but threefold. Now the TriScreen 2 has two 10.1 inch screens. That's 1920 by 1200 and they're full HD LCD IPS panels. They have an aspect ratio of 1610 and a refresh rate of 60 Hertz. You're looking at 180 degree uh, screen rotation and adjustable brightness. Now from a power perspective, like we mentioned, you can use this on a variety of devices, virtually any device on the market that supports um, a screen of this size. So if you're looking at something that is 12 inch all the way up to 20 inches, this is gonna work. Now as soon as you add the Zbeck TriScreen 2 to your laptop, you're faced with a lot of different connections. Basically, two USB-C with DisplayPort technology, video and power, pass-through charging, mini HDMI, and video only options. Now, if you're concerned about how much weight you're gonna be adding to your laptop, well, it doesn't weigh that much. We're talking about two pounds, one inch of depth, 7.5 inches of height, and a width of 12 inches. This is really something that will fit easily in a backpack. Now, before we actually take a look at the tri-screen system that you see right here, what we're gonna do is look at some of the adapter that comes with the actual unit. So you have a series of USB-C cables that are gonna allow you to connect this to a variety of devices. Now, one of the most powerful accessories that I would highly recommend that you get is this one right here, especially if you're dealing with a MacBook Pro uh, 2021 that has the M1 chipset. So this is a DisplayPort adapter. Right, so basically with this DisplayPort adapter, you plug uh, these into the actual monitor themselves. You notice that there is a uh, smaller HDMI and then a USB-C. And then what you have right here is what you would connect to your laptop. So this is gonna provide the power, and then what you do is you'll get video and audio coming through these when it comes to the second monitor. So as you see in my setup, I have a MacBook Pro 2021 and it works like a charm. Now taking a closer look at the Zbeck TriScreen 2, there's a couple things that I wanna highlight. First of all, you have this kickstand, right, on the back. So what we're looking at is the back, and this is actually, if this was on your laptop, this would be facing uh, away from you, right? This would be on the other side of your screen. So basically what you have here is a little kickstand, and this kickstand is gonna keep this system, um, especially if you have weak hinges, uh, um, you know, so that it doesn't fall back. Now, I wanted to show you this side because I wanted you to see how this is gonna work. So pretty much all you're gonna do is pull these sides like this, and you notice this is the monitor coming out on this side, and then as I pull this one out as well, the monitor is gonna come out on both sides, and then it's gonna extend fully. Once you pull it out completely, right, it's gonna basically come out in a hinge, so it's right there, and now you can move it up and down. So lots of flexibility, and when you pull these out, you basically have almost like a cockpit of monitors. Now sliding back the monitors into place is pretty simple. All you have to do, you can put one hand on the top if you like or on the side, is slide it in like this and then slide it in like this. I've been able to slide them in also both at the same time, but you'll have to get used to that. Now if you've been asking yourself, how do you connect this to the laptop? Well, this is how it works. Uh, this is really simple too. Um, notice uh, basically what you have is some rubberized, I would say, grips on each side. And then what you're gonna do is you're going to open it up just like this. Notice how it expands. I'll show you that area right here. I think this is the cool part. And once you put it on your laptop, it kind of locks in. Doesn't scratch your laptop on either side. And again, all you're doing is one of these things, and it locks in. To remove it, all you do is pull it out, lift it up, and it locks out just like that. Now each of the screens have their own menu controls so that you can make any adjustments you need as you need it. Your two USB and your HDMI are on the bottom as well. Now let me show you how simple it is to install this on your laptop or your Mac. So here I have my MacBook Pro 2021 M1 chipset. I'm just gonna take the screen just like I showed you. This is a Z-Back tri-screen. Place it right here in the back, expand it, position it where I want it, and then just close it just like this. It's installed, that's all it takes. Now to extend the monitors, all you do is you pull from one side, like this, all the way till it's out. And then once it's out, you can tilt it forward and you can do the same on the other side. Or all you have to do is operate with one if that's all you want. Now we're gonna take a bird's eye view of the TriScreen 2 in action. Now in order to connect the Z-Back TriScreen to your MacBook Pro, especially if you have an M1, 
uh, you're gonna need to have a DisplayPort adapter. Now ZBEC also provides this adapter which supports DisplayPort technology. I also have a driver that I've installed. So all I'm gonna do now is connect this to my Mac and power up the monitors. Now I've connected all three monitors and let me show you how I have this going. So I have the display adapter, right? Running that display adapter software because this is an M1 series uh, MacBook Pro 2021. The display adapter is connected to my USB-C port here. Uh, it's running over here and it's connected into two ports, USB-C and then also then the HDMI. It's connected to the USB-C so I can power this monitor and then the HDMI is to be able to give me the video and the audio coming here. On this side, I have another port on my uh, MacBook Pro, and again, I only have two, and I have it connected to another USB-C port, and then that's powering this monitor and also providing audio. Now, one of the things I can do is, because I have another USB-C port here, is I can plug in my USB-C power adapter, and this will serve as a pass-through, and it will charge my Mac, so I won't run out of power. But all three are connected, and I just wanna show you as I move my mouse over, see how my mouse is now over there? And then as I come over here, it's over here. And this looks pretty, this looks pretty cool, right? And so I have all three monitors functioning and let's just play them so you can see um, how the performance is. So I've turned off the volume. So each one of these are gonna be running uh, so you won't hear what's going on. And I'm gonna go into this one and turn this on as well. So you can see the overall performance and that you know, things are, are, are performing well with no stutter. Let's just make sure we get that mouse pointer there and we'll hit play. So three monitors all going at the same time on my MacBook Pro 2021 with an M1 series chip. This is pretty cool. So guys, that wraps up our review of the ZBEC TriScreen 2. I'm telling you, I've been using this for a little bit over a month, trying to get the feel of it and to see how it expands my productivity. This definitely boosts it two to three times. See you in the next video.